<laughs> and our forecast for today, we don't like the rain. No, no, no. You know, here's, here's one of the good things about the rain. Okay. The temperatures have been a little more reasonable. Very true, very true. So, you know, you, that's we, the silver lining, that's right? That's the silver lining. You know, we started out last week with temperatures in 95 degrees, 97 very degrees true. at Audubon, 90, 93, 94 at the airport. Uh, the last couple of days, you know, we've only been up into the 80s and the mm -hmm. very low 90s. And it's a give and take. It's a give and take, exactly. Yeah. Now, we're going to see those high temperatures again. Okay. Uh, just in time for Essence Fest weekend. <laughs> so the folks that will be coming here are going to be burning up, that's for sure. Take a look through our West Jeff Medical Center camera. Overall, it's a mostly cloudy morning here in the Crescent City across southeast Louisiana. Some similar conditions. Uh, this afternoon, there may be some breaks, some sunshine uh, in our future. But, um, you know, for most of the morning, I think we're going to be very, very much like uh, what, you, what you see right now. So your headlines for today are more rain today, showers and storms in the forecast for your Monday and most Mostly dry conditions will return to us on Tuesday, and I think for most of next week it's going to be mostly dry as well. We've got uh, high pressure down in the Gulf of Mexico bringing us those winds out of the Gulf, some uh, more northerly winds just to the north of us, that low pressure area is creating some, uh, some, uh, uh, somewhat of a mess for us here in southeast Louisiana and across many parts of the Gulf Coast states this morning. Uh, some places the rain is actually dissipating, but we still have scattered showers and storms all across southeast Louisiana this morning. I'll take you in a little closer and show you some of the areas of the, the worst rainfall, the heaviest rainfall, and some of that is moving over uh, Lake Maurepas now. It's starting to dissipate just a bit as it gets towards uh, Lower Tangible Hope Parish. If you're in Strata, you'll see that rainfall, if not now, in about uh, four minutes. So uh, it's in your very near future. All along 10, there's some light rainfall now, but the heavy rainfall uh, has been occurring there for the Last couple of hours. So if you're trying to make it towards Baton Rouge on 10, you've got a very wet drive ahead. If you're going on 12, still some wet conditions there as well. But the good news is the lightning strikes have fallen off just a bit over in that direction. Here in the city, Metairie, Kenner, down towards Wagaman, Marrero, over in Algiers, East New Orleans, some light rainfall as well, and some uh, heavier rainfall making its way into Terrebonne Parish right now. And some of that's headed towards Oak Forest and over towards Homa. And you're going to see that in Homa in about uh, 20 minutes or so. So uh, we'll probably see some uh, lightning. Uh, to develop down here in, Tangible, uh, in Terrebonne Parish, not so much so across uh, the rest of the area, although later this morning, this afternoon, we'll probably get a little bit of that as well. Some uh, scattered rainfall on the Mississippi Gulf Coast as well. Here's the forecast model. I'll put this into motion, show you a little bit less rainfall as we get towards the noontime hour. Then into the afternoon, it picks up a bit, uh, especially on the North Shore, Mississippi Gulf Coast, down here on the South Shore as well. Not a lot of rain across the area this afternoon, but still about a 40% you know, chance for many parts of Southeast Louisiana. We'll wake up tomorrow with some showers along the coastline, which will lift across the south shore into the noontime hour and into the afternoon. Our rainfall chances fall off just a bit for your Monday afternoon, then into Tuesday as well. So, uh, while we've got some rainfall in store for us for the rest of the day today and into tomorrow, Tuesday, Wednesday, and I think Thursday through Sunday, we're going to have some much drier conditions. Right now, 74 at the airport, some rainfall out there, 87% humidity. Your hour by hour forecast shows you our temperatures uh, this afternoon. Uh, well, yesterday we got into the low 90s for most of us, but this afternoon I'm expecting those numbers to rise into the upper 80s to the low 90s for your highs. That southwesterly wind will continue at about 10 miles per hour. Uh, so expect the moisture to remain high, the humidity to remain high. If you're going to the Crab Fest Lacombe, uh, expect some rainfall out there uh, as well. You might want to bring the umbrella, maybe the Jazz Fest shoes. If you're going to the St. Tammany Crab Fest, uh, same thing. Here's a quick look at your seven day forecast and notice those dry conditions and the much higher temperatures. Latanya, the much higher temperatures for the rest of the week and into the weekend. Thank you, Damon.